Hey guys, Sasuke here, and welcome back to Dungeon of the Endless. So we unlocked our boy here. An ex-member of the Social Forces, Ken's biggest problem was the fact that he enjoys self-inflicted pain. Always willing to join a knife fight armed with a tennis ball, Ken was the first volunteer for any mission that was hazardous and brutal. So we've unlocked him permanently, he is a bro that we can just choose now. By the way, I don't know if you noticed, but we don't really have any weapons on anybody yet, and uh... Makes me a bit nervous. But, let's start, shall we? So we have enough to power two rooms at the very start. And that's kind of unfortunate, finding that with no, uh... Nothing to build, man. No like, no like at all. Okay, well, let's go ahead and build our food replicator. And have him start piloting this room. Is it piloting? It wouldn't be piloting, right? Controlling, operating. Operating's the word we're looking for. So he gets a new passive. Do you get anything? You don't get anything. Do you get anything? You get a new active. I'm gonna go for the passive first. Oh, he can operate now. Ooh, that opens up a lot of interesting possibilities now. So the second we find another place to operate, we're going to be real happy. Is this really another one-off room? That kind of sucks, man. Buying those early one-off rooms sucks. What is this purple gas? Is this dangerous? It's not dangerous. This is the food replicator. Will this auto-level this to two? I bet it won't. But we do need that. Whether now or later. We're getting such good food. Um, so his wit will go up slightly, which means he'll operate things better. Next level he gets a passive. We might, we might go for his passive, honestly. God, there are so many decisions here to be made. And I just want another room that I can operate, honestly. Really, another room. Well, poop. We're already going to have to leave somebody behind. I really hate opening up all these rooms like this. If I had a decision, it would not be this. That's not too bad, though. Um, We can go into double food operators. Which is gonna get scary, because now we only have one person exploring. This is the first time to sit in this room until it's done. Hmm. Don't like it, boss. I don't like it at all. We really need more power. Wait, is this auto-powered? Oh, baby, it's auto-powered. Are these auto- They are auto-upgraded to level 2. Wow, we're getting a lot of food now. So he gets... Plus 2 whip. Heroes on floor, so everybody gets plus two wit. That's nice. So now we're, wow, we're generating so much food. So this is the last segment down here. I kind of want to build something. Um, we could do a third food and go crazy. Or we could go industry and start stacking it up, but we're, we're already near 100. I don't think we really need the science, because it's only plus three and they'll only equal up, up to plus five. I mean, we're gonna need it eventually, though, so I say let's make this the floor where we just go all out. Since this is auto powered anyway, it's not like we're really losing anything keeping somebody down there. How much wit does this number four guy have anyway? 14 isn't terrible. Yeah, it's not bad at all. So, next person we're upgrading is our level three friend over there. I wanna bring everybody close to the same level. Oh, this is a big ass room. And enough dust to power it. Not bad. I don't... These kind of look like tentacles and I don't like it. Hmm. I'm getting really nervous with this floor though, because there's a lot of stuff that is uh, causing me discomfort in every direction. There's two rooms here. There's a room that branches off here. Hmm. We need enough to power this room is the problem. So 
So we're gonna give her the additional power. I think she's okay. Yeah, she's fine. Nice. So now we empower this room, and now we can bring you over here. Hmm. We'll keep it cool for now. So he gains a passive next level. We'll go ahead and save up the 65 for him. I think we want everybody in the same level instead of power leveling one person up. I might be wrong. Not of power. What? Oh, because we didn't have this one. Okay, so now you can come over here. I don't like this gas in here. It's freaking me out a little bit. So we're getting quite a bit of science now, so... Wait, no, no, you stay here, you're slow. Oh, this slows us, look at that. It slows us a lot. Crap. So we get a higher level science replicator. We can get HP regen to everybody. We can get a Kip Cannon. I kind of like the idea of the Kip Cannon. Hmm. Because it could go up to 100 power, which is quite a bit. 2.5 seconds is a long time, but... I think if we stack up a lot of stuff from it, it'll totally be worth it. God, I move like negative speed at this rate. So we find something, which is... Tools Belt. Gives more wit. Okay. Does this give wit? This gives three wit. So guess who gets it? Wait, what does this do again? What's one health regen for monsters in the room? Okay, yeah, so every monster in the room you get HP regen. So, he can repair damage modules. He also has um, 19 wit, which is equal to our other character now. It's looking pretty good. Wait, were you gonna level up again? No, you're gonna get active. It was you that was gonna level up. We have enough. Oh, he can repair stuff now. Interesting. And he gets another passive? No. He doesn't get another passive. I'm crazy. I need to start using these active cooldowns. It's only for him and everybody in the room. So now we get to choose up or to the right. I'm going to go up in a desperate attempt. <laughs> I'm really nervous about enemies coming through this room, though. We might, we might drop some stuff in here and come back to it. We're doing a bit of a swip, switch up here. Heal. You're not allowed to die, yeah. I'm gonna keep healing you until you're just... You're the healed master. So now there's only gonna be one. We can put some stuff in here if we want. I kind of rather have it at the crossroads here, though. Is there anything we could, like... I'd rather this be depowered and you be in here than this be unpowered, because this is so far away from anybody's help. Right here is close to the crystal. We can bring Buell back to help him if he absolutely needed it. Now there's only one room that's unpowered. We did use a lot of food there, though, but we're going to get a lot back once we open this up, so... It's not like a nightmare or anything. Is this done yet? No. How many more turns do we got to wait? One more turn. That's not too bad. Open? No, oh, yes, no, what? What did that do? Hello? Electromagnet one supposed to deactivate modules in some rooms. How do we reactivate them? No power. You can repair. I don't know if this is what we need to do. I'm thinking this is what we need to do, though. Our science one is still online. So can you repair this? Or is this just deactivated for like a turn? I'm not sure. Hmm. OK, 
Okay, so this is activated. Um... I wanna make one of these. I don't know where I need to make it, so I'm gonna wait till we need it. Let's go ahead and make one... here. Oh, it takes forever to make while we're doing this. Go and heal up a little bit. Probably gonna need to heal up again in a second. Maybe? No, we're good. A little scary. Not gonna lie. These things are pretty strong. Huh. Getting into some bad situations now. Do we want even more food? Is this back to working? It's not. Does this just not work anymore then? Is that what I'm getting at here? This will just never work again? So we should just transition to a new room? We could transition to here. It's closer to the home front so we could fight with our friend. I don't know if this is just gone forever or not. And I really don't want to destroy it, but the thing is, it's making our cost of creating other things go up. Oh, you can stay up here. Um... You know what? I'm not sure if it's ever going to work again. Has he activated modules in some rooms? It doesn't say it'll reactivate over time, it just says there's no power to it. Sorry, my friend. Thing is, this will keep us closer to the home front, which is something I like. It has defenses in it. But something else I like, and I can always retreat back here as stuff gets too scary. We're gonna go ahead and auto retreat back here. I think it's by far the smartest decision with these uh these things in here. Not bad. And he's still activating that, so we're still getting a buttload of food every turn. Damn it, we had to go every wrong way, right? Heal up, baby. Making me real nervous, to be honest. I feel like we're we're at that point right now where a mistake could end it all. Cause these other people aren't strong, man. We need a traitor and we need to The thing is uh, we do have three rooms where things are gonna be spawning now. Maybe we have to abandon this and come assist our team. There's ability anyway. I'm sorry, we're gonna have to abandon this. I, I'm getting scared. We're we're wasting so much food. I mean, are we? We lost what ten food from abandoning that? Are we gonna save more food by having to help you less, or you know, it's always that the toss up. One thing we can do, now that I am using my brain again, is we can just have you positioned, like, right here. We can unpower this room, power this guy up, so we have more people at the forefront of battle, right? There are no unpowered rooms down here, right? Yeah, we're good. So now we can... Now we have a person in each one of these rooms, so we're going to have one room, two rooms feel spawning in. And we're just going to fall back. Okay, now that we're all in this room together, it should go a lot better. Still watching HPs. I was trying my heart out not to heal there. It ended up working out as scary as it was. God, we're still going this way, man. It's 
so frightening. I hate it. We can't build in here because we don't have power. I think we're definitely stockpiling a little too hard. Maybe we should drop this room and come back around, but that one only has three modules in it. I wanted one with a buttload of modules in it. We're only three away from getting a new... I, I think we're gonna pause this next time. Unless this is the exit and then we're just gonna be happy. That's a lot of enemies. Okay, everybody come back. Cheese it! Keep cheesing it! Wow, that's a lot of damage you're taking. Oh my god, we're taking so much damage. Oh my god. This is unsustainable as as a mofo. There's there's so many enemies. God, look how much food we use. Way too much food. We only have enough for two more hills. Pulling out for a tactical retreat, boys. We're rotating out. Holy God, that was way too much. Zero food. Alright, we're building a lot of things. Okay, so the way this is gonna work is... Hmm... I need you down here to generate a buttload of food. I need you in one room so they don't spawn. I need you in another room so they don't spawn. I need you at the forefront checking doors. What we're gonna do is we're just gonna run them through this gauntlet that we have when enemies spawn. And we're gonna pray that things go alright. What's in this room? Is there anything even useful in this room? Or are we just... Alright, here we go, I guess. Oh my god, we found the exit. The crystal is literally 17 miles away from this thing. How the heck are we going to do this? I think we have to have this one. We might be able to skip past that one if, we're, if we set somebody in that room. We can probably skip past this one if we set somebody in this room. So first off, let's just get everybody to come here. Let, let's use our thinkers for a second here. You go ahead and set yourself here. You go ahead and set yourself here. You set yourself here. Oh, only the exit is not. Okay, fastest is probably still number three, right? 30, 40 speed rather. Yeah. Alright, so you're gonna be here and you're gonna start here. The second he gets to this room, we draw everyone towards this room. And we go up, 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 up to the exit, which is powered. Now, everything this way is powered. So once we get here, we'll be okay, but we just have to get there first. 
So... Now we pause. Make sure. Play cool, baby. We're low. This this might be one of our last floors. Two, four. The second he leaves the room, now we go. Now we go. Oh my guy, so slow. Come on, come on, come on. We have a lot of modules here that's, that are going to help us quite a bit. I think we're okay. Because there are going to be monsters that want to fight the modules. It's going to help us quite a bit. And there's people that are running straight towards them, but they're really slow. But they're really fast, so that means they have really low HP. And... We're done! We survive one more floor. I feel like this probably isn't going to be going on for too much longer, to be honest with you. I haven't killed anything for a few minutes. Feels weird. I'd agree with that. Feels real weird. Um, we're going to start this floor a little bit, and then we're probably going to end around a uh, normal time. Alright, so this is really nice. We start out with this, but we can start with the food replicator, because we got to get that up as soon as possible. Now, who's the weakest? You or you? You have higher HP regen, but it's because you're in the floor, same room. You have higher defense, you have higher DPS, and higher attack power. So, number four, you're going to be chilling out for a while. What is this tightrope? Nice one speed, plus 47 attack power. Oh, it's a weapon that nobody can use. Feels bad probably end up selling that eventually if we if we get lucky enough to find somebody to sell it to so one two and three you're all gonna be coming with me okay that went well we don't have we don't have anything to keep building yet um scary just pray we keep getting dust is all I gotta say. This is an auto-powered room. That's pretty convenient. One, two, three. Come with me. Oops, I did not mean to do that. Can I remove that? You see what I did? I accidentally marked him as one, two, and three. He's like, it's like a, I did a control group or something like in uh How did I do that on accident? Create a hero group. Is there a destroy hero group? Hmm, not like this. Okay, so I can just change you to one, you to two, you to three, and you to four. So now it's just like it was previously. I'm just an idiot, so. So that's auto powered, so that's nice. Everything up here is powered and we're generating some stuff. I don't know if we're gonna be leveling very much more though, to be honest, because food is so sparse when you have to use 90% of it to heal. Ooh, free stuff. 30 though. We can do that next turn and just pray it works out. Actually, who's better? You have more defense, you have less speed, but you have higher, lower DPS and lower attack, so I guess that is that. The so one and three, come with me. Come on, dust. Let's try this. Please, no death. Dust Factory didn't do anything, boys. This might be then for your old, uh, your old pal here. I totally forgot to leave you in this room. Please don't spawn a monster. What is this? Stelly Moon Seed Boss. Here's 100%. What? Oh my god, we moved so much faster. Wow, we're already at a bad spot. It's auto powered room. I like that.
Maybe we should fully flesh out a side before we decide what to do. Does this need to be powered? It definitely needs to be powered. Let's join him together. We shall take these enemies down better together. We don't have a single weapon, I think is our main problem. Oh my god. Oh no, I didn't heal in time. Oh, I'm so sad. I hit G instead of H. I should have just hit spacebar and paused. Now we're sad, boys. Let the tears flow. Indeed. Indeed. We don't have armor or weapons on any character. I don't know if we've gotten unlucky or we've been doing something terribly wrong. If I had to guess, it's probably just doing something terribly wrong. Minor modules have more attack and heroes have more attack. So we found two of these. That's crazy. Man, I want to do this so bad, but I feel like it's just not the right idea. It increased our attack power by a little bit, but not really too much. We get a new active, though, and the active could be anything. Damage over time. Here's a room. Damage over time. What? Oh! So if she's alone, she goes ape shit and kills things. It's a three turn cooldown now, which is quite a bit. We're going to have to run back here. Oh my god, we found the exit. You know, we're not going to get much further. Let's admit that to each other, okay? I know it. You guys know it, whether you want to admit it or not. We both know that we aren't going to get too much further. There's nothing else we can even power down. Yeah, because we have to have all these up and running. I want to explore for a little bit more dust, but how smart is that idea is the question. Because I don't even know if we could survive a single wave of monsters, honestly. Who's the fastest now that we've lost our fastest? Everybody's pretty fast now. I guess our number two is the fastest. So two, come here. Number one, come here. Number four, go down there to keep monsters from spawning in the exit. We're just gonna try to cheese it. I don't. We're not gonna win this campaign. We're we're starving for resources in every department. We, let's admit it. We we have effed up. Here uh here goes nothing. That hundred percent move speed for heroes is so good. We got so lucky, man. Uh no, it, if there were four of us, we could sing some great quartet stuff. Agree. We're halfway there. I think we're. I think we lost. But we got halfway. That's a pretty good, you know, for your first like run. That's pretty good, right? A new picture for your album. So we've unlocked this guy too. So now he's a part of our gang, indefinitely. Alright, let's make a single turn and let's end the episode. I, I gotta make one. This is the kind of game where you just wanna say one more turn over and over. Alright, well, no, 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 no. Aw, oh, we're bad. We're bad and we should feel bad. Oh my god, it's the extra speed thing. How lucky can we get is the question. I think we need one of these. As much as I hate to do it because we still need food. We're gonna take a couple more turns, I lied. Oh, we gotta do this. No, no, no. No, we can't move! I'm an idiot! Oh my god. It didn't actually affect us too much except we lost that bonus. And I accidentally have you hotkeyed incorrectly.
Oh my god, I just sneezed and nearly died, boys. Okay. I have you hotkeyed incorrectly, that's why I couldn't pull you and I was trying to. Oh, mistakes have been made. So this isn't powered, this is powered. We have effed up now. We have effed up. Another one of these? Speed even more? Wow. If we could find the exit, we would be golden. But it's 30 minutes, so I'm going to go ahead and end it here, guys. Let's hope the, uh, the next session goes as well as this one. Well, better than, than, you know. It didn't go very well, I'll admit it. But yeah, like it if you guys did end up liking it. It helps me with the new series. It lets me know you're enjoying the video, and it helps me make more content that you guys enjoy. Leave a comment, you know. If you guys feel like it, uh, let me know tips and tricks I would appreciate very much. Or just about anything, honestly. I love hearing from you guys. I love talking to you guys and everything like that. But subscribe to the channel if you have not already. I recommend it to anyone who may be interested. And I hope you guys have the most amazing day in the whole damn world. See you guys.